question number four. Encik Adi, Puan Balkis and Encik Chandran are three members of the first generation in an organization. The constitution of the organization stipulates that each member needs to recruit two new members. Okay. Assume each member has successfully fulfilled the constitution of the organization. Question A. If the total number of organization exceeds 12,000 for the first time in the nth generation, find the value of n. So this question, right, what they're asking is, so it's basically a sequence question. Okay. So we know that the first, the first term is 3 because there are 3 members. And then each of them have to recruit 2. So that means that you're going to increase by times 2 right? because each of them going to get 2 members. So you're going to be 6 and then followed by 12 and so on. Okay. So from here we know A is equals to Oh sorry. Wait, uh, A is equals to 3 and the common ratio R is equals to 2. So what the question is asking. They ask you to find the value of N when the total number of total members exceed 12,000. So total members means SN. Lah. So SN exceed 12,000. Okay. So that's what they want us to, to They gave us the in, that information and they want us to find the value of N. So we just have to use the SN formula. SN formula is A. In this case, R is more than uh, more than 1, right? So it's um, 2 power n. Okay, wait, I just straight away substitute. Now. So you get 3 times 2 power n minus 1 over 2 minus 1. Exit 12,000. Okay, so here you get 1. So it's not going to make any difference. So 2 power n minus 1. So I'm going to bring the 3 the other side. So 12,000 divided by 3, I get 4,000. Then 2n, 2 power n equals to 4,001. So you want to find n, right? So what we can do is, we can add log both sides. So we get log 2 power n. So the n, I'm going to bring front here. So I get n times log 2. And here also I have to add the log. Okay, I need to add log both sides. 4001. Okay, so since log 2 is a positive value, so when I shift the log 2, the sign won't change. Okay, we have to check that. Huh? If it's a negative value, then when you shift over, you get, um, you have to change the sign. Okay, so n more than log 4001 over log 2. So n is more than 12, uh, sorry, 11.97. So n is approximately 12. Okay. Question B. Hence, find the difference between total number of organization until the n term. So that means uh, Sn. And the number of members in the n term. So that means question B. Uh, Question B is asking you to find the difference. So that means the S12, the sum of all members on the 12th term, because we found 12, right? N equals to 12. So on the 12th term, minus the T12, the number of members in the nth generation. That means the 12th generation. Okay. So they're asking you to find this. So you can use the manual way. That means use the SN, uh, S12, SN formula. Okay, substitute the n value as 12 minus the, then use the tn formula. Okay, you can do that or you can straight away find S11. Why? Because S12 means what? T1 plus T2 plus T3 plus until T12, right? You're going to add up all of them and you're going to minus T12. So what does that mean? So you just have to remove this. So what? Everything in front here, you just count. Huh? So this will be T1 until T11. So basically, you're finding for S11. Clear? So this is a faster way. Okay. If you capture this, then you can straight away do that. Lah. If you didn't notice that, you can just do the manual way. Also can, the long way. You still get the answer. Don't worry. So S11 
11 would be 3 times 2 power 11 minus 1 over 2 minus 1. So your answer is 6141.